It is the first fluorescent amphibian to ever be discovered. Lee's results open up an exciting frog perspective of visual physiology and ecology and the role of fluorescence in terrestrial environments, where it has been classically considered irrelevant this little frog never loses its load. Your skin takes on ultraviolet light and emits as a bright green color. Light bulbs that emit only UV light are also called black lights, partly because they sound cooler, but also because we cannot see it with the naked eye. This makes for a very cool effect when this frog is under a UV light that seems to glow on its own because all we see is the green color it emits. It is even more exciting in this case because the daylight of the polka dot tree frog is rather bland. It is greenish brown with spots and is exactly the type of animal that would walk right back in a rainforest. You probably walk by it at night too. There is not much UV light in the dark so you would not illuminate the area the way some other animals glow. Phosphorescence and bioluminescence are the two main forms that can shine at night. Bioluminescence is how many ocean creatures light up, like the algae lit up beaches in Tasmania or the fireflies you see in your backyard. It works through a reaction between an enzyme and the pigment that produces enough energy to shine. It does not have to be charged by a source because the body is producing light itself. 